Um, ciao. Anyway, so. Hi guys, I'm back. And I'm in the back to school season. I'm going to be giving you guys four super easy hairstyles. Require minimal heat. You don't take a lot of time to do them. I could get these done in less than 10 minutes. And yeah, they're just my go-to hairstyles for back to school. So the first hairstyle is going to be like a half up, half down. Slick back like spiky-ish bun. I'm sure you've seen these and they're really cute and super easy to do. So you're gonna begin by parting your hair in the middle part. And now you're gonna part your hair half up, half down, and then just tie off this so that way you don't like rip half of your head out. Now you're just gonna take a little bit of gel and put it in the front. Now gather all of your hair and just start brushing it and smoothing it back. If you don't like your forehead and you still wanna like have that snatched, like slick back look, you have to like brush down and then brush back. Now that you have it for the most part smooth, you're gonna take a little bit more gel and put it in areas that you tend to like have um like what is it called? Like loose hairs, like the little like hairs that pop up. And you're gonna take a smoothing comb and really just make sure it's all smooth and there's no bumps. Now that your hair is all smooth, you could tie it into a ponytail. Now just twist your ponytail and just wrap it into a bun. Now you're gonna leave this much of your hair out and secure it with a rubber band. Now that you look like a little angry bird, la, la, la. you're gonna take some gel in your fingers, gel the ends of your hair. Now you're gonna take a few bobby pins and just literally place the hair wherever you want it. Oh, I just heard my hair break. That sucks. And then you could straighten the rest of your hair, but I have three more hairstyles to show you, so I'm just gonna save the heat for this one. Okay, staying on the theme of half up, half down, I'm gonna show you another half up, half down. It's literally the exact same tutorial, but I'm just gonna take the bun out. Okay, I'm just fixing it so it's smoother. Okay, when it's like that and all smooth, you're gonna take a claw clip. So you're just gonna flip it up. Put the claw clip in and literally that's it and it makes it look like you have fake hair i actually am going to straighten my hair a little bit for this like i said it's easy it's quick requires no heat but i like to do it anyways so yeah okay guys it's literally a whole different day and i put on the same shirt i got ready real quick because i was editing the video and tell me why this hairstyle literally deleted. So I was like, ugh, I'll just do it again. Start by parting your hair into like a side part. Now once it's like this, you're just gonna part it down. And then tie the rest of your hair up, but leave a little bit out so you could tie these together. Grab some gel and a smoothing comb and you're just gonna slick this side part down. And then once it's slicked back, just tie it to this part with a little rubber band. Now you're just gonna section this part of your hair down. And then you're gonna part these into three sections. And we're gonna kind of part it like in a triangle. And then you're just gonna secure it off with a rubber band. And then you're gonna do the same thing two more times. Okay, and I got these little gold clips off of Amazon. They were like two bucks for like a pack of like, I don't know, like 20. Um, and I'm just gonna take them and put them in where the rubber band is. So now that it looks like this, I'm gonna go ahead and straighten my hair off camera. Okay, I'm not even lying, that took me a minute and 45 seconds, and I know because I'm literally watching a video while I straighten my hair. For this last hairstyle, you're going to part your hair into a zigzag part. Then I always part it a little bit in the middle, then I just go in a zigzag, and it should be good. So now that it looks like this, you're just gonna go ahead and take a little bit of gel and you're gonna brush these back. It's kind of harder because it's um, zigzag, but you're just gonna kind of slick these back. Okay, they're slicked. And now, just going into like sort of a low ponytail. Now that it's in a low pony, you're just gonna take a claw clip, pull your hair up, put the claw clip in, and honestly, you could leave it like that, but we're not gonna stop there. Take your curling iron and you're going to curl your hair. You're gonna take medium, like not small size pieces like this, and you're just gonna curl your hair. And once it's done curling, you're gonna hold it in the palm of your hand. Take a bobby pin, pin it to your head. And you could let a little bit of the curl out. That's like the best part. So continue doing that, and you just kind of have to play with it and see what looks good. It works better if you have curly hair, honestly. Hats off to you, but I don't, so. 
I have to curl it. So I'm gonna do that real quick. And the trick to this is when you're placing the curl, make sure it's above the claw clip so it looks like your hair is just sitting there, kind of, if that makes sense. Okay guys, this is the fourth and final look. I'm obsessed with it. This is what it looks like from the back. It just kind of gives like, you know, it's curly and it's there. If you made it this far, thank you guys for watching so much. I'm planning on posting more content soon. I'm super excited, but I don't really know what to post. So if you have any ideas, look, let me know. But yeah, see you in the next one.